Yes. Now, here is the u haul -it truck, and that's going to be Paul Burke's oh, so temporary have, home uh -huh. for the next two or three days until so he moves into his new apartment. So their things did not actually have to sit out on the street. They're sitting. That's where they were sitting out on the street, right there. Oh, there. See? Okay. There's Lady Claire. <laughs> so someone else. And that's put Kevin them out on Shockley, the, out and there's the Paul street. Burke. See, I think the that's kind sheriff of put, this, put oh. their stuff well, out. It's kind of convenient to get the sheriff to come and move all your stuff outside for you, and all you have to do is load it in the truck. Some of their stuff is messed up. Yeah, it was broken. Oh. Now, how could they get something like this picture of our Lord and just throw it out in the damn street? Where so that was terrible. Yeah, yeah, I think that's, uh, isn't that sense. what you call a sacrilege? They just give me one hour, I could have, you know. Well, you know, Paul Burke, of course, is the son of a preacher man. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure that he has did plenty have of religious books there and all of that rubbish. Effect on him. But you can see they, the sheriffs came and they carefully took out all of Paul, Paul Burke's thing. Uh, Look, that was a damage. Look at that. Look at what they did. Look at that. Well, that's not quite and as religious. Fucking jagged piece of glass. Look at that. Somebody. <coughs> well, that <coughs> really <coughs> upset <coughs> Lady Claire Parker. Mm -hmm. Look at the I can imagine that. Check it that out. Come here. There is Paul's brand new typewriter that just threw Look out the onto the street. All over yeah. the ground here. Well, I guess the sheriff's Chips department. Chips of the typewriter. Not, all over you know, they're the not the best movers tip. in the world. Look at the typewriter. Well, they, they have to do so many moves per day. Yeah, I mean they've got a schedule to maintain. Look at that shit. Look what they did. It'll never work again. None of that stuff will ever work again. Look and see, there's Paul Burke started. among all of his stuff. There's his VCR. Look at what they've there. done. <laughs> well, um, there was no way shit. that he could have gotten the U-Haul a little sooner. I guess he could have. He probably didn't get around Look to at it. That. Look at probably that. busy. You got all that packing? I guess right, maybe yeah. he could have sent in the rent yeah, check. Right as a way of preventing this. But he was moving <laughs> in a few days. Yeah. And I guess he just didn't feel like. There's a beautiful picture of Eloise that. Montague. It's, it's a lovely picture. The yard. See, there's his VCR right there. They moved that out. But they placed it carefully on this, these shelves. Filthy. It's a religious uh, book. They, it looks there. like they placed that pretty carefully. Yes, what are you going to do with it? There's someone oh, crying yes, there. Mm -hmm. He ain't got the sense. God gave him that. Dick, now, and I tell you what we're going to do. will alert his attention to to Kevin right now. I'll show you what these people did to the I stuff did. here. We this is the kind of stuff they did. This is a recreation. Look at this. This is a direct recreation. That's yeah. exactly. terrible. Now, that I really did don't like think that. that the people from the sheriff's yeah, department yeah. would go oh, to the trouble don't. of climbing up on a truck to throw the typewriter down. I think they would That's just throw it true. out the door. That's probably true. <laughs> and this, of course, was did that. male did nudity, that which either. always turns Lady Claire Parker into okay. a raving maniac. But I don't, I don't think anyone in the sheriff's department did that. Do you? There's a picture of, they have a black velvet picture of Stevie baby. Wonder. Oh, that looks like they... There's some more stuff there, careful. so we're kind of going through all of this. He does have a lot of stuff. stuff. Luckily, for the sheriff's department, Paul had all of his stuff already in boxes oh, in well the front of the house. So it was easy for them yeah. just to or come in yes, yeah. and take the boxes out house. to the street. Mm -hmm. Isn't that pretty expensive? Expensive. You can't get evicted from a truck. It's a good thing his street is a dead end. They can't get the marshal in know? the truck because it's not in the room. Because if you were on a, a street where people pass by, that stuff would be would have been gone in two minutes. Now, Todd Butler is living now with Lady Claire Parker. I'm not sure where Kevin is going to live. And Paul, of course, is living in his u haul at truck. And there's a poor panda bear. <laughs> That's sad. Just amid in the ruin, there's an old light. He really does have an awful lot of stuff. And the guitar case. Well, this Christmas There's a, wreath looks like it's a this Christmas wreath. Is this just Paul's stuff? It's not Todd's stuff, too? A man, I think that's a mandolin. Is that... A mattress. That's all Paul's? You know, there's all kind of... There's stereo yeah. there. Luckily, there was no rain today. A mm -hmm. chimney, you know, fireplace screen. Well, it's raining right now. Hopefully he has it in the U-Haul by now. But look, this is uh, Tuesday. And look, now we're going to take a once-in-a-lifetime so no look I mean, no inside of Paul's empty see. apartment. And we can see what it was like in all of its glory. There it is. There, we don't know where the cats are. I guess Margaret took the cats, probably. And so there's Paul Burke. And Margaret left there's all his ago. stuff. And then the, there's a shoe the that was just calling? sadly yeah. left there. And all kinds of stuff there. And so I posed the question to Paul Burke, are you going to come and be on our show tonight? And he said, yes, as soon as I get this truck loaded. Let's see, I'm fixing to pose the question to him. Now I'm okay. going to say, Paul I Burke, I guess it. you're not going to get to come and be on our show tonight. 
See, that's a map sure of the city of Atlanta. Soon. Some pictures there, yeah. some records. There's yeah. there's Paul Burke there. I'm fixing to pose the question. So I guess you can't come over and be on the show tonight, Paul. Why the hell not? He said, why the hell not? Of course, that's because... That's what we always say, why the hell not? <laughs> so he, uh, because he was he's Paul here. Burke. Well, and he was here in spirit. I mean, you got a tape of him, he got that much time. So that's exclusive know. on the scene report. It's, it's just like he was here. Impressed. The only mm -hmm. TV show in Atlanta to cover the Paul Burke, mm -hmm. Todd Butler, Kevin Shockley, Eviction Live, as it happened. Mm -hmm. It was exciting. I am glad they live on a dead-end street, though. That could have just...